Howdy folks. So here we are, video number four, I think, of our trailer repair. We have all of the uh, steel members in. I have not finished welding yet. Uh, just tacked a couple of spots and gonna go around those. A lot of this, uh, a lot of the steel's decent, but man, some of it is rotten. So, but uh, this trailer is it's not the first time this trailer's been rebuilt. So anyway, this might be the last rodeo on this uh, this old girl. But uh, this trailer lasted me. This the the flooring of this trailer lasted me ten years. Uh, when after I bought it, and it already it, it had already been rebuilt. So uh, I think this will probably last another ten years at least. And when you're welding into this stuff, man, it's hard. It's just it's. You have to just pound and grind and flake away just to find some decent steel. Uh, little tip for you, if you are welding to something like this and you have gaps or you need to just raise up, like I couldn't weld to this stuff. I had to weld to this because this is a plate that is actually in decent shape there. Um, if you need to fill a gap though, get some rebar, chop it off, set it right on there, weld top and bottom works super good i just like that i do love welding did a lot of welding in college did you know that jerica and i kind of almost met in a welding lab yeah jerica used to well she was a welding engineer uh, but then became materials joining engineering because they added plastics to uh, the degree there and uh by the way if you ever go visit your girlfriend like for at a summer in top intern job where she's working at like a uh, uh, materials analysis facility and you're walking through the whole humongous place and you see a weld that you think is a piece of trash, don't say anything. Because if you say something stupid like whoever welded that should be shot, uh, you might never live it down for the rest of your life right <laughs> well, yeah but she likes a good joke so <clears throat> so do i well anyway uh we're gonna take her over to the bandsaw not jerica the trailer and uh take her over to the bandsaw after i'm finished uh just welding these guys and um cut our lumber for it and i gotta get this installed today so I guess I might be working a little bit after dinner. Well, that's about it. Eh, decent welds. Okay, okay. Let's see if we can find any. Eh, just decent. You know what? The cows don't care. Though. That's a pretty. That's a pretty all right one. Eh, it's a, okay. Not the best. At least that welder shouldn't be shot, though. You know, maybe just reprimanded a little bit. All right. Have a good one. Thanks for watching. This is Matt Shady Grove Ranch, Jefferson, Texas.